All right, motor, 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 motor. This is an easy outboard, L05. I gotta say, this thing looks amazing. Okay, let's go put it together. Oh, looks like this thing goes right here. Didn't come with any instructions, although everything looks pretty obvious. So putting the screws in here, I was thinking, oh great, I'm gonna have to go get my small screwdriver. And then I look in the box, it comes with one. Oh, isn't that nice? A nice screwdriver too. Next, I've got what looks like a propeller blade here. And that goes right there. Oh, great, I'm gonna have to go get my uh, hex keys. Wait a minute, let's check the box. Ha-ha, they do have it. Man, this thing comes with everything. Ha, <laughs> cool. They gave me one extra screw of each kind, which is kind of nice. All right, this top thingy here looks like it goes this way. I guess I just plug this into this and the other thing goes to the power. Sure looks cool. All right, I think I can plug it in. I don't really have a spot to mount this yet. It'll just sit there. All right. Oh, I need both hands. Hold on. All right, it's plugged in. Now I turn on my main power. Oh, nothing explode! Nothing explode! Nothing explode! Okay. Now let's turn this on. I've got it on economy low power mode right now. Oh, it's got a green light. I think that's a good thing. Whoa, man. That's got some power on it. Ooh. Jeez. So that's on the lowest setting and I barely moved the stick. And that thing was cranking. What is this monster? All right, well, I think I can go for a little, little, little test. I think, think everything's doing the right thing. Engaging slow drive. Oh, wait, still tied to the house. Ha <laughs> Okay, re-engaging slow drive. I should probably put my solar panels up in the horizontal position so I can see. But, ah, nobody's here. Oh, don't worry about it. I can see it. I can see ahead. That's all I really need to know. Okay, first tests always make me a little nervous. You know what? I'm going to tie the rope to the motor. It's not going to come off, but just in case it comes off. It's not going to come off. I'm, I'm just going to tie a rope to it just in case. All right, just a little bit of just in case safety. Yeah. Connected. All right, this golden motor 
005 activated. All right, let's do it. on solar panels. Oh, nice. And the sun is pretty low. It's like 4.30 right now. Oh, that is beautiful. If I can get this much speed this late in the day just on the solar panels, I think the solar panels are driving the motor and two of the solar panels are still charging the battery. Oh, this is great. enjoying the low power right now. That's so nice. Oh, I can't believe it. It's just on, the, just on the solar panels right now. Yeah, I don't know if you can tell, but the sun is pretty low in the sky back there. Oh, this is so nice. I know, I think I said this is so nice like a hundred times. I just came back here and uh, this was loose. That's why the vibration was going on. I just didn't tighten them very well. So I tightened them again, tested again. Super smooth now. Well, let's go again. I'll aim you this way this time. Solar panels engaged. Thing on. Let's go. All ahead slow.
mighty happy with how that went. I need to mount the motor better so that it's lower in the water because it was sucking some bubbles. Uh, other than that, everything on the boat was working great. Let's go check that the batteries have in fact been charging while I've been driving around on solar panels, not using the batteries. 54 volts coming out of here when I've got the batteries on. So yeah, they're higher, great. So where do I want to mount this thing? I want to keep it in a good protected spot where it's not going to get rained on up here, but also somewhere you can, you know, be in the water good. Ideally is right behind one of the pontoons. However, uh, that would mean this could get rained on. So I want it somewhere. Maybe I can keep it where it is and just have it lower down. I don't know. Let's think about it. I think it's dinner time. All right, Golden Motor guys. I got to give you guys an A+. Plus. If this performance keeps up, oh, I am so happy with this. I am not super happy with the mess I've made. Whatever though, I got all my electrical wires in, now I can clean this up. And don't worry, I'll get some better shots of the boat going when I get the motor mounted right. Ah, oh, I gotta give an A plus to the Solbion solar panels too. Man, those things are amazing. Look how light they are. Oh, it's so nice. And uh, just to get that, that kind of performance when the sun is maybe 15 degrees up. Oh, I'm really, really happy with everything. Okay, maybe not everything. I can think of some things I'm not happy with. But everything to do with this boat and the solar panels and the motor, oh, it's going really well. Whoa, famous last words. All right, I better watch that I don't trip and fall or something.